So guys, you you see these powerful women I have on the show. I, I'm surrounded by powerful women at home and with, with my family and on my show. It's just it's so enlightening for me to be able to do this mm -hmm. because there's so many different shows out here. We have all this buffoonery, have the reality, and it has its place. Mm -hmm. But we have to start pushing things like this, stuff that's going to educate people, stuff that's going to empower people, that's right. stuff that's going to inspire people and just teach people how to be their best. And speaking of that, so we know who you are. We know what you're, yeah. we know what you're doing, the foundation, but now we got a surprise, huh? We do. We, we got do. a surprise. We do. So you know how some people talk the talk? But you want to see if they walk the walk. Right. We're going to walk a little bit. We're going to walk just a little <laughs> bit on the Simeon Henderson show today. All right? My, my producer laughing at me, Jose. We having fun today. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something. I got to say this. Because we're talking about how, uh, how you work together, how you build people up. Let me tell you something about my producer. The man came in. He was referred to me by my wife, right? Mm -hmm. And she's like, oh, he want to know about, you know, how to do this and do that and do that. And I'm like, yeah, 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 I heard it all before. Like, everybody wants to get in it, but they don't really want to get in it. Because mm -hmm. once they get mm -hmm. in it, they're like, oh, I'm good. Because right. they don't, they don't yeah. want to stay in the test. Yeah. This man came in. He went from being an intern to becoming a producer to helping me write stuff for the show, wow. put the show together, shoot the show. And, and the thing, I appreciate him so mm -hmm. much. Because he's in it with me for real. Right. It's not about the money and none of that. It's about the craft. It's about getting the word out. And it's about the people. Mm. And that's why I told him, I said, man, it's going to come, brother. I promise you it's going to come. Mm -hmm. And when I go, you go. When you mm -hmm. go, we go. That's what it's about. And that's what it's about. It's and then I get, you know, a marketing person, Ashley. She comes on and she's helping. And then, you know, it's just those little pieces you put that's together. Right. Yep. And speaking about putting pieces together. We know it's a good show because there's a little boy in the audience, a little eight-year-old boy, and he's pumped up. <laughs> I wish y'all could see what I see. The man is up, running around. He throwing up fists. He he pumped. He's pumped. So I know you guys are loving the show. Okay, he pumped up. So, but we're gonna get a little more pumped up in here because we're talking about Miss um, Victoria Van and her foundation and what she's doing and how she's providing for people to go to college and giving them um, the opportunity. We have a special guest here today. And uh, can you tell us her name? Uh, yes, yeah, so uh, Miss Yvette Thomas. Okay. Uh, she's a little camera shy, but I forced her to come up here. I was like, you gotta come and tell your story. Mm -hmm. um, just a little bit of background. I was driving my son to school and on my way to work and I was listening to 1390. And I heard Yvette's story. It was in December. Mm -hmm. And Yvette's story, it moved me immediately. And I heard guys said, give her a scholarship. And I pulled over. I called the radio station. I demanded that put me on air. And I said, I need to talk to whoever this person is because mm -hmm. I have some money for her. They gave her 300 <laughs> I was like, I'm giving her 1000 How about that? And then, yeah. you know, of course, everybody went bananas. And I have, her and I have been in contact since. Mm -hmm. But I, I think she could better tell her story, which I hope she will. Um, but really what moved me was that she's a single mother like myself. And she sacrificed so that her daughter can go to school. And her daughter went to a university. And she went out of state and her daughter did this on her own. And wow. so the sacrifices that this mother made to make sure that her daughter had better and then she positioned her for success moved me because that is something I would do for my son and I am doing for my son. And single mothers deserve to be championed. Yes. So this is my way of championing her and saying, Yvette, thank you so much. Thank you so much for your sacrifice. And here's a seed to your ministry. And hopefully that this seed will help your daughter continue on in her education. So we're going to take a quick break and we're going to come right back. Don't go anywhere because it's literally going to be about 30 seconds. And we want you to see what Miss Victoria Van and her foundation has for this young lady. You don't want to miss this. All right, we're back, everybody. I hope you've been enjoying the show. And it's been awesome. Miss Aleda and Miss Victoria, they are so, 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 so enlightening. And, and I love their energy and what they're doing for people. And so speaking about what they're doing for people, uh, Victoria spoke about a young lady that she heard on the radio. She heard her story. And um, it's Yvette Thomas. And I want her to tell you a little bit of her story. And then we have something for her because we want you guys, we want to end this show on a real, 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 a very high note. And um, we want to see 
What's up with Miss Yvette? How you do? Welcome to the show. Hi. Welcome to the show. So Thank now you. you can officially say you've been on the Simeon Henderson show. Yes. And it's <laughs> a pleasure to have you here. Thank so you. Yvette, why don't you just give us a little bit of your story? So I lost my place. Mm -hmm. um, trying to help my daughter go to school. Okay. And that's how my sister submitted a letter to um, 1390. Mm -hmm. And that's how I got in contact with um, Miss Victoria. Okay. How she got in contact with me. Okay. And, um, uh, now, when you say, now I'm, I'm going to help you out. I'm going to help you okay. out. So, when you say you lost your place. Mm -hmm. Helping your daughter go to school, your daughter go to college. Mm -hmm. So, so that means that you decided instead of paying your rent and doing that, you're going to pay for your daughter to go to school and get an education. Yes. Wow. Yes. Come on, you talk about a selfless act. Yes. You talk about the love of a mother. Yes. What, what, like, what was going through your mind when you made that decision? What were you thinking about? Because we we know you weren't thinking about going to lay down in your bed. <laughs> what were you thinking about? I was thinking about my daughter having an education. Yes, ma'am. And I struggled with it, mm -hmm. you know, of but it, I I just, I wanted her to have an education. That was very important to me. She mm -hmm. wanted to go to school, mm -hmm. and I wanted her to. That's right. Know, so that was important And to you me. were willing to give in order so she could receive. Yes. And that's why I didn't want you guys to miss that, the power of giving. Mm -hmm. And because you gave, and because your heart was bigger than the situation, you were introduced to Miss Victoria, right? Yes. And she has something for you. I do. I do. I do, I do. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, well, first, here's your $1,000. Um, this $1,000 is going towards your daughter. Right. Okay. I already put the university name on it, so I want no problems. All right, going so it's going, going to, to the daughter. It's to, already to stamped, mm -hmm. delivered, just drop it in the mail. So that $1,000 is going to help her get on her way and get back in school, fully in school, and then pursue her academic mm -hmm. wow. goals. But, Mom, Thank you so much. I wanted to take some time and, and honor you and celebrate you because I believe that you are a champion in your own right, and so many moms like you are unsung heroes, and we do this every day. You know, and I don't even know how sometimes we match our clothes, but yeah, we mm -hmm. do it and we're yeah. still out there making it happen for our babies mm -hmm. and we all need to be pampered. So I'm pampering you with a spa day. Oh, wow. Thank you. A so here's day. for you. I need you to go and get you a massage, go get you a facial. <laughs> I don't know what you want to do, girl. Go get stretched. I don't know. Whatever they say, get you some hot stones on your back. But just go and go and go and go and go. And then just thank you, thank let it be about you. you. Just thank be you about so you, okay? Much. Thank you. No, thank you. Thank you. And then finally, we so have... Go, so don't, don't miss this, oh. though. Don't miss, so don't miss this, guys. So she just gave $1,000. Her daughter, she desired to see her daughter go to school and get the things that she need. And this is helping her do that. And then she gets a spa day and all of that, right? Yes. So what I'm going to do, the Simeon Henderson Show, we're going to, um, I don't know, what's your favorite restaurant? What do you like? What do you like? Really? Fridays. <laughs> so that's so easy because i'm you know, i'm a mother okay okay you know, so so this is what we're so this is what we're gonna do we're going to see anderson show is going to give you a 50 dollars gift gift uh card to fridays Thank you. right so i mean that should be enough right yeah so for you go have a nice meal yes. you can, i think you can even take somebody with you yeah, yeah you can take so. me she <laughs> just, she's just, she just made my job so easy <laughs> she, fridays okay no no but, but what we're gonna do seriously what we're gonna so do funny. um so i don't know um what i'll do is i don't know um we'll figure out how we'll get it to you if you have Nowadays, everything is digital. If you have Zelle or Quick Pay or Cash App, um, we'll get it to you. And um, you can just go enjoy dinner. And then, you, so you'll have your spa day. And then you can enjoy the dinner. And then, you, you um, young man, could you go get that for us, please? Or did you forget? Go get it. Hurry, Hurry up. up. Hurry up. Chop, chop. Yeah, um, Miss Victoria, she has something else that she wants to present you with. Come on. <laughs> You give it to her. And this is um, the co-owner. Thank you. This is the co- Can you see her? <laughs> this is the co-owner. Come back here come really back, quick so they can back. see you. Come. Now, now you, yeah, you come right over here by your mom. 
So, yeah, right there. You can sit on your mom lap. It's okay. This is the co-owner, co-founder of the foundation, and he's only eight years old. Say hi to the people. Hey. Okay, now you can go. <laughs> See you later, buddy. Thank you so much. We we'll appreciate you, son. Thank you. Okay, so um, so what we're going to do, we're going to end a show like this. Uh, can I get a lady to come back up, up here with the ladies? So I have these ladies here. You come on up here. Have a seat. You can come on. We're we'll in the show like this today, and I'll be careful. Um, so, guys, you've been watching the Simeon Henderson Show where we're giving a voice to the people, and you're watching women that empower each other, women that empower the community, that empower the world, virtuous women of God and women of faith. And what we want you to understand is no matter what it is that you want to do in life, nothing will be withheld from you if you just love yourself first, know who you are first, and everything else will fall into place. Trust me, women, I know you love your kids, but you got to love yourself before you can love your kids. Okay? So where can they find you at? www.ebjv.org and then I'm on LinkedIn as my regular name Victoria Van and Facebook Victoria Van Yvette where can they find you at somebody else might want to bless you with something you got any social media uh, Facebook Yvette Thomas Yvette Thomas okay <laughs> and then the later uh, you can find me at my website www.thebestyou.net and also on Instagram at the best you network and you can find me at the Simeon Henderson Show every Thursday night at 8 p.m. You can find me doing the morning motivation every day on Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook. And I do it because I love you guys. And let me tell you like this. I appreciate you. Thank you to my executive producer, Jemani Anamdi, Jose Perez, my producer, Ashley Easley. And I got to give a big shout out to my wife, Tammy Henderson. Thank you for all that you do. I appreciate you. I love my kids and everybody that supports this show. Let's go higher. And how do we do it? We do it together. So like I always say, Philippians 4.13, you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. And be symbolic, simply your best. And being deeply rooted stimulates growth. We'll see you next time on the Simeon Henderson Show. I hope you had a ball because I did. And I love watching people receive and watching people give. We'll see you next time. Peace.